mesothelioma and asbestos cancer peritoneal. Peritoneal mesothelioma is a tumor of the membrane peritoneum. The peritoneum is a thin membrane in the organs in the abdomen consisting of mesothelial cells. Peritoneal mesothelioma is associated to coming about from having previous exposure to asbestos, and in many cases is found through routine abdominal X-ray YS and CT scans showing something different than normal. Peritoneal mesothelioma can stay dormant in your body for many years, before it will be seen, and for this reason many people years after they have been exposed to asbestos will be diagnosed with peritoneal mesothelioma. About 20% of all mesotheliomas are peritoneal mesothelioma, and they can be of two types malignant and benign. What are the symptoms of peritoneal mesothelioma? Abdominal pains, weakness, weight loss, loss of appetite, nausea, abdominal swelling. The symptoms become more severe over time and should be checked out by a doctor. If they do not, they will cause increasing pressure on your abdomen organs, causing much discomfort and will lead to bowel obstruction and distension. How is peritoneal mesothelioma diagnosed? A peritoneoscopy is performed, and if there is a reason to be concerned, a biopsy is performed. A biopsy is the process of taking a piece of tissue to be given to a pathologist for analysis. The pathologist uses a microscope to analyze the tissue and make the actual diagnosis. Currently, it is still unknown why asbestos causes the mesothelial cells to be cancerous, and it is unsure how many fibers are needed for the tumor to occur. Many treatments exist for peritoneal mesothelioma, however a cure has yet to be found. What are some of the treatments available for peritoneal mesothelioma? Chemotherapy, radiation therapy, surgery. If you are feeling any of the symptoms noted above, ensure you have it checked out early. The earlier the diagnosis of peritoneal mesothelioma, the better chance the treatments will be effective.